Hey YouTube, this is me, Mercedes, or officially Mercedes B, as y'all know me. Um, I'm coming to you today with a unpackaging video, pretty much from some hair that I purchased within the last, like, I don't know, two weeks or so. Um, but pretty much right now, I apologize about my camera. I can't turn my light on behind me because it's doing something weird, so I don't want it to have, like, that overglow behind me, but if it's bothering y'all, I could turn it on, but... Yeah, let me just do that now. Hold on. That doesn't have to work for now. But, yeah, like I hate it. It's, I know, I see what it's doing already, but. Whatever, I'm not going to worry about it. Okay, anyway, so, um, I went back home to Detroit, um, and I purchased some here from Queens vs. Remy, um, they have their own website, QueenRiverRemy.com. Come get your hair, girl, or Zay slogan. Um, but I've been seeing them for a while on Instagram. I know a couple girls here in Buffalo that actually wear their hair. And um, so I decided to go ahead and give them a try. I wanted to try a different, like, brand versus the Indian that I've had and the Brazilian that I have now. And then I also have had Brazilian before. But, anywho, specs on the hair. Um, I got... And 18, a 22 and 26 inch bundle of hair. It's in the Eurasian Body Wave. I paid 74 the 18 inch, 22 was $80, and the 26 was $90. So it was only like $10 difference for the upgrade. Um, but pretty much came to the $254.40. Got this on November 24th. So this was around Thanksgiving week when I was in Detroit. So. It was probably like a holiday sale or something. I don't know. I just ended up getting it here because I thought it was pretty reasonable. This is my 26 inch. I haven't sealed my wefts yet. Um, I'm actually waiting on my weft sealer to come, which I usually will purchase from um, hairstitches101.com. But pretty much the Eurasian hair, very nice gray, very nice, very bouncy. Um, no beards, no ends splitting, no shedding, no none of stuff like that from what I've seen just coming out of the packaging. Um, their bundles come wrapped. This is the 26. So, of course, it's going to be a little bit smaller. But, again, I got a pretty nice size of hair on this bundle. Um, so, not, not satisfied with it or, you know what I mean, like I'm in love with the hair. Um, medium to semi-medium luster, I want to say. Not really a high, high luster, but... It is what it is. Um, also got a 22 inch. It's 22 inch. Looks the same exact way as the 26 inch. A little bit more hair on the bundle. But again, it's because it's a shorter hair. As you know, longer limbs to get less on the bundle because they're going by the weight of it. Um, but pretty much they all weigh the same. They're about four ounces. I weighed them myself once I got them. So I checked that out. So. These have not been washed. They have not been anything to them. They already come pre-washed. There was no courtship smell. There was no nothing issues with that. And like I said, I went into the store and actually purchased these. So I got to inspect the hair in different types and styles that they had before I even purchased. So this is my 18 inch. This is the largest of the items. Again, this is pretty decent size. And these are all nice they don't have any issues with the beards the hair is very silky very smooth i'm not getting any shedding none of that stuff with it no corn chippy smell again like i stated all right now those all came from queens virgin remy a location was in southfield they have other locations in atlanta they have one in um las vegas i believe they got one in birmingham alabama i think they got one in um virginia areas like dmv or something like that and then they got one somewhere else. Can't remember exactly where, but just check them out. Um, pretty good pricing overall, and they do wholesale. So for all you stylists out there, that's why I was really going out there to speak with them about. But also, there was a closure that I wanted that I see here. Give me a second while I'm talking to y'all. But there was a closure that I wanted, and I did not buy it while I was there. Silly me. I don't know. Whatever. Ended up getting the closure from AliExpress. Now, with that being said, first purchase I've ever made from AliExpress. Anything, including here. So, 
Sorry, I'm hearing stuff in my house. Anyways, so I got the hair from AliExpress for my closure. It is a 14 inch closure. Let me give you the specs on it first. And this is after I've washed it. I'll explain to you what I did with it. I got this from the store is AliExpress Top Sale Virgin Human Hair Best Quality. I'm not lying about this. I just wrote this down from the actual purchase. Um, but the seller's name was Tommy Chi, C H I or Chai. I could be saying that wrong. Whatever. Um, it took three to five days for shipping from an e packet. I'm assuming that's something to do with China sending out to the states. I don't know. Whatever. But it was three to five days shipping. I got it mine in four days from when I ordered it. Um, the item type is it's a lace closure, four by four, and it is Eurasian loose wave. Um, originally it's like $52, I think, or something like that. But again, I got this around a holiday sale, so I only paid $31.50 for it. Kind of had me suspect to it, I know. But it's 14 inch middle slash free part. Um, color is 1B. It says it's a black, but it's a 1B. And it's 130% density. My lace color is medium brown with light bleach knots. Because I have a lighter scalp, I wanted them to have the bleach knots already. So I don't have to do that. And that's a good thing for that. But um, I only paid the $31.50 for it. Um, I got it in four days. Now when I got the hair, it looked... Like a master mix is what the best way I could put it. I was a little bit annoying and I didn't really want to hear. So I ended up contacting the seller. They told me that I could send it back or something like that. But I had to like do a dispute process, which took a couple days. But they give you a certain time frame before you can send the items back. Apparently, I missed that gap. So I was stuck with the closure. So I was a little bit annoyed, to say the least. And right now, it's the week before Christmas. So... Um, I was just like, you know what? I want my hair done for New Year's. And I've been sitting with these bundles forever. I just want to go ahead and change my hair up. So, I was like, let me see what I can do to try to bring this closure back together. And I'm just like kind of at a loss for words. And I'll explain why. The hair pretty much came all in the same way. Had the like little lunch lady net on it or whatever. Keep the curl together. The ends were very curled at the end it looks manipulated like it was processed or something and i didn't like that and then when i touched it it felt really 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 dry like really dry and i was really annoyed by that and then on top of it i combed through the hair maybe i shouldn't have done that i combed it from the ends up to the root area but it was shedding like you wouldn't believe like nobody's business i was so pissed and I wanted to send it back to him so bad. I was just like, you know what? Whatever. I'm just going to like see what I can do to fix this. Or if I can't fix it or if I just need to buy me another closure. So what I did was I ended up having some shampoo that I use on my regular hair anyway. Believe it or not. Um, I got some of the organics with the X. Um, repairing our Pui Ginger Shampoo and Conditioner. So I have both of those. Um, <laughs> so I have both of those. I actually use them on the hair. Now, believe it or not, the minute that this hair turned, touched the water, I used warm water to shampoo it. Now, before, it had like an off smell. Not like corn chips, but really like a strange odor. As soon as it touched the water, the instant change in the hair was crazy as far as like the curl pattern went more naturalized it got like not so tough so like i said i don't know if it was because the hair was super dry or who the hair that came from had dry hair i don't know but that it, it instantly changed once it touched the water which was strange to me then and not in a bad way though strange in a good way then i used a shampoo on it it instantly started like to change the texture of the hair it instantly got smoother it got softer i could see the actual luster in the hair and i was like wow believe it or not this is really a good set of hair so 
I used it with the shampoo and then I conditioned it. But what I did with the conditioner is I deep conditioned it. So I shampooed it twice just to make sure. I didn't get any bleeding of any colors or anything like that. So they let me know it wasn't dyed. And like I said, it was no problems whatsoever. Once it touched the water, I didn't have any tangling. I didn't have any shedding before I even shampooed it. I didn't have any shedding while I shampooed it. When I conditioned it, I put in the conditioner first. Then, in my hand, about the size of a quarter of each, I used the Blue Magic Hair Food Grease. Absolutely. The wheat germ oil, coconut oil is in here. It's really good for your hair. But I used this on my daughter, but I used this with the hair. Also, I used the Blue Magic Coconut Oil version of this as well. And... I use the Softy Herbal Grow. I love this because it smells like watermelon. I use all this stuff on my kids' hair. So pretty much and on my hair too. But um, that's only when I'm greasing my scalp or whatever. But anyways, I used those three sides of a quarter in my hand. Emulsified it until it got liquidy. Put it on the hair. By the way, I also washed the closure part of it too. And that seemed to soften up as well. So I don't know. Maybe it's a conditioner, shampoo. I don't know. Whatever. But anyway... I made sure that the hair was completely saturated from knots to ends. And the lace had the solution on it as well. Made sure that it was glued out, combed the finger through it. Put it in the plastic bag, microwaved it for 30 seconds. Took it out, repositioned the hair while it was still hot. Put it back on for another 30 seconds. After the 30 seconds was up, wrapped the plastic bag up in a paper towel or a towel. Let it sit until it got room temperature, which was about an hour, hour and a half maybe. Rinsed it out. Let it air dry. It turned into this, which I love. My knots, again, are already bleached, so I don't have to worry about that. And on top of it, the hair smells amazing. There is no corner chip order whatsoever. This curl pattern is amazing. Like I said, it's just like normal wave pattern. I'm not not excited about it my ends are not frizzy or dry at all whatsoever so i but i was shocked i was able to bring this closure back to life but i did and i'm getting wait to install this it's actually going to be installed um on the 30th because my birthday is next month so i just want to go ahead and get my hair situated so that's one less thing i can worry about um but in the meantime um if you want the specs of the closure I'm going to put that link below. I'm also going to put in the link for the bundles of hair. Again, I got a Eurasian Body Wave, or Natural Wave rather, in a 18, 22, 26 inch. I have a 14 inch Eurasian Body Wave closure. I use the Organics line of the Repairing Awapui Ginger Shampoo and Conditioner. And to deep condition with the conditioner, I use the Blue Magic Coconut Oil, Blue Magic Hair Food Oil, and also the softy herbal girl so pretty much those items you can get for like maybe two dollars for the larger bottles this one will probably be like a dollar or two by itself these two were eight bucks together closure again 31.50 the hair together was 254 so pretty much not a bad deal for under 300 dollars and again um i'll show y'all the pictures you can follow me on instagram um it's mercedes e underscore class mercedes e class also the same on twitter or on Facebook, you can just find me Mercedes Bynes or Mercedes E. Bynes. And um, if you like this video, you can definitely like it, comment, subscribe, or share. And thank you. Happy holidays to you and your family. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. And I'll see you soon. Bye.